came all the way down through the Catawba River chain into South Carolina. And our own uh, Greg Suskin is now live in the Riverwalk area where, Greg, I understand we haven't seen the water that high ever. Yes, yeah, Steve, I've spent a lot of time out here at Riverwalk. I've never seen it like this. People who live here, I've never seen it like this either. You look right back there, you can see this is where the boat ramp is. You see the fence there underwater. You can't even tell where this boat ramp is here on the Catawba, but this is way, way lower than it was a couple of hours ago. Let's show you some of that video right now. This is outside the Pump House restaurant right next door. You can see not only the parking lot completely underwater, but the water went into the lower floor of the building. Fortunately, the restaurant is up on an upper floor, so that's good news. But the water did get into the lower floor here. Down the river, the boat ramp completely submerged. The walking trail submerged as well. And take a listen to some of these numbers. Emergency officials say normally the flow of the Catawba River, the speed is about 3,000 cubic feet per second. It's considered dangerous to be on the river when it hits 10,000 cubic feet per second. This morning it was measured at 60,000 cubic feet per second. That's how fast this river is moving. Of course, people live along Riverwalk, have businesses here. When folks in those Businesses saw this water rising, they were concerned. Just worried because I don't have flood insurance. I'm concerned about my neighbor. Uh, the pump house is their first floor is half, I mean, you can see the water is halfway up the door. Yeah, and you saw that there. Now, emergency officials here say if the forecast holds to the rain they expect, this should all continue to recede and shouldn't be a problem. Of course, the city has no idea at this point when they're going to reopen the kayak launches, but I can tell you it's going to be a while. Steve? Yeah, thanks, Ray. This is going to take a while to unwind itself for sure. In fact,